As we begin another day, let us pause for one minute of silence. And now on to today's news. All global ambassadors, including hosts, are asked to meet in room L403 during the second half of Rock Block on Friday, April 9th, and or after school um, to finish the final details for this year's summit. Don't forget to turn in your signed field trip form that day, and please see Mr. Briscoe for a pass or forms if you don't already have one. The Rockridge PTSO will be sponsoring a Kaplan practice test event on Saturday, April 11th. Students will have the option to take versions of the current SAT or new SAT. The test will be offered from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Please see the website to, go, to get to the link to pre-register or find Ms. Alder in the Career Center for more information. Did you know that April was Math Education Month? If not, Move Out with Data has a couple activities in store for you this week. Um, to help celebrate, stop by the tables at lunch next week to enter a guesstimation contest, the scavenger hunt, and the pie in the face raffle. Yes, we'll be throwing pies at our teacher's face at the pep rally next Friday. So get your tickets and win a chance to throw a pie. Stay tuned for more details or visit the Moo Alpha Theta website page. The following colleges will be here at Rockridge during April. Elon University will be visiting on Wednesday, April 15th at 2 p.m. Extra word of advice. If you are even slightly interested in Elon, you should sign up to join us. Mr. Bradbury of Elon always gives extra points to those he meets when looking at applications. And yes, he does remember you. The University of Georgia will be visiting on Wednesday, April 29th at 2.30 p.m. As usual, you must sign up to visit through Navian's Family Connections. See Ms. Alder if you have any questions. If you are interested in attending one of the U.S. military academies, then you should attend Academy Day at the LCPS Admin Building on Saturday, um, April 11th from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. The International Club is holding the second audition session starting at 4 p.m. today in the cafeteria. Students who signed up to perform need to attend one session of their choice. Tomorrow, Thursday, April 9th, all performers must attend the dress rehearsal starting at 4 p.m. in the auditorium. Don't miss these important, important dates. The I night is just days away. For more information on these announcements and other events, they can be found on the Channel 9 scrolling banners. And now over to sports. So there will be a wrestling meeting in Coach Grinup's room in L404 tomorrow during the first half of Rock Block. We will be talking about important information regarding events in April as well as the rest of spring. And some are like uh, Grinups or Russo know if you cannot attend. And um, tonight's competitions include boys soccer, travel to John Hanley, JV competes at 4.30 and varsity plays at 6. Girls soccer tackles John Hanley here at The Rock, JV at um, 6 p.m. and varsity at 7.30. And the softball and baseball games are canceled today. And um, boys tennis takes on Warren County here today at 5 p.m. and girls tennis travels to Warren County and competes at 4.30 today. And now on to me for the weather. Good morning. Today is filled with rain and a high of 51 and then more rain and then continue cold until Friday, which will be 80 degrees but still rainy. <laughs> the weekend looks promising with the two days in near 70 degrees and sunny weather though, so I guess that's something to look to, but it's <laughs> rainy. Now back to Mr. Duhlman for the Pledge of Allegiance, after which the bell will ring for second block. Have a great day. Bye. Please stand and join me for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated.